be giving you an instructional video on how to clean a room. First, we want to obtain our supplies. We grab some Windex for cleaning the windows, a lemon pledge or Swiffer for the hard surfaces, a nice vacuum to clean the hardwood, or optional, the carpet, a feather duster to get rid of that pesky dust, microfiber towel, and some clean sheets for your bed. Second step is we're going to have to pick up the stuff in my room. Alright, so we're just going to be uh, grabbing uh, some local products in our back corner. And we're going to want to make sure we clean all this up because when we vacuum, you don't want that stuff to get in the way. Now I've got rid of the rest of the stuff in my bedroom and now I can begin the cleaning process. Now you grab your feather duster. Alright, so now you have your feather duster, you're going to want to start cleaning. So come over here camera guy. See, we just clean away the dust. And if there's any residual dust later, you just clean it again. All the dust, you don't want no dust. And uh, we're gonna come up here, make sure you clean the fan. I mean, that's when the majority of your dust collects. Just make sure none of that gets on your bed. Perfect. The next step is you're gonna wanna make your bed. See here, my bed is already made, but we can tidy it up a little bit for us, uh, for your people out there. So you just wanna, you're gonna wanna get on there, remove any, anything there, remove your pillows. This isn't a traditional bed, but you just want to move it on over to the side and make sure it's as close to the other side as possible. Now you can begin cleaning it, tucking it in on the sides, make sure it looks nice and uniform. Now it's time to vacuum your room. You're going to want to find an outlet so the vacuum can operate. So you're going to want to rattle the cord a little bit, not too much, just a little bit. You're going to want to plug it into the outlet. We're going to want to get to the beginning, unravel it, make sure you're all ready, and now we can start. You want to hit the button to make it go down. You want to turn it on. You're going to want to work your way in the back and work your way out. Make sure you get all the corners. As we continue, you're going to want to wrap it up. If your room is pretty clean, you only have to do one swipe. But if it's dirty, repeat. Make sure you work your way outward. So that way you don't step. Make sure you work your way outward so that way you don't step on the newly vacuum carpet. Once you cleaned your room with your vacuum, you're gonna to wanna to unplug it and you're gonna to wanna to roll it up. My filter's pretty dirty and we're going to want to empty it. So uh, we press the push to empty button. Now it pops open. We just, now we just start emptying it in. Don't be scared to get in there and use your hands to try to get some of it out. It has to be as clean as possible. Now one, once it's uh, successfully clean, you're just going to want to push this, close it, give it a quick shake. Alright, so you have any hardware in your room, you're going to want to make sure you take the proper precautions to clean it and to protect it. You're going to want to take some hardwood cleaner, just give it a quick spritz, take your microfiber cloth, just give it a nice rub. You want to make sure you get all the residual spray off, because if you leave that stuff on, it will stain. You're going to want to clean your windows, but I'm going to be using this window because it's much larger and it's easier to see. You're going to want to give it a quick spray. 
Let it foam up. Give it a nice wipe. But we just want to buff off any excess residue that we have on there because you don't want to let it stain. And you see, we've got a nice clean window on here. But you'd want to transfer this over to your room. But I'm just uh, doing it on this window so you can have a much easier idea of how to clean it. Now, I've showed you how to properly clean a room. But we want to go back and we're going to want to replace all the items that we originally got rid of. So you're going to want to take all the stuff that you got rid of and put it back in the room. We've successfully cleaned a room today. We're going to want to zoom in on this hardwood. See it glisten. Look at the bed. It's clean. The floors are clean. Everything is clean. And this is how you properly clean a room. Thank you for watching my how-to video.